hope you're doing all right. Today I'm here with a get ready with me to show you how I went from this to this. This is a nice neutral makeup look, perfect for a summer party, and I'm also going to show you what I decided to wear. So make sure to stick around and give it a big thumbs up if you enjoy. So obviously I'm going to start off with no makeup. And first of all, I'm going to use my Boots Simply Sensitive Moisturiser and rub it all over my face. For primer, I'm going to use my Maybelline Baby Skin, focusing on my nose and slightly spreading it out. I find that this primer is definitely more suited towards those with dry skin. As for foundation, I applied my Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum Foundation in dabs all over my face and blended it in with my Real Technique Stiffening Brush. I also mixed this with a little bit of moisturiser to make my skin appear more glowy and to help reduce the dryness of it. Recently, I've been loving the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer under my eyes. It gives just the right amount of coverage and makes me appear more awake without being cakey. I put a small amount under each eye and then blend it in with my ring finger. I also use this on my nose as I find that this is a better concealer to use for the drier areas of my skin than the next concealer that I'm going to show you. Next is the Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer. This is perfect for any blemishes and redness that I may have. As for my eyebrows, I've recently been using Soap and Glory's Brow Archery. I first apply the pen end to slightly fill in my brows and then go in with the other end to help shape and fill in any spots that I may have missed. For me, it's essential to apply my Urban Decay Primer Potion before applying any eyeshadow. I just rub a tiny amount over each eyelid. I'm firstly going to apply the Shimmery Champagne Colour from Collections Eyes Uncovered Palette with one of my Naked Palette brushes. I'm applying this to about three quarters of my lids. With my Naked 3 palette, the first shade I'm going to use is Liar, a shimmery brown colour which I apply to the outer half of my lid. I then go in with Nuna and apply this throughout my crease, making sure to blend it in a little. Finally, from my Naked 3, I then go in with Factory, which is a gorgeous darker shimmery brown colour, and apply this in almost a C shape on my lid and throughout the outer half of my crease with a slanted Elizabeth Arden brush. I then make sure to blend all the eyeshadows together. Highlight my brow bone and also make sure that there are fewer harsh lines on my eyeshadow. I then apply the white colour from my Sleek Au Naturel palette, which I also find helps to give a better shape to my eyeshadow. After that, I then grab my Fit Me Concealer again to remove any fallout and to help shape my eyeshadow. I make sure to apply this from the corner of my eye to the end of my eyebrow. As for eyeliner, I always tend to use my Soap and Glory Super Cat Liner. Although it still takes me ages to apply just a thin line, this eyeliner is pretty easy to use. But I still can't do winged eyeliner to save my life. I then used my e.l.f. curlers to curl my lashes. 
For mascara, I went in with Maybelline's The Colossal Volume Express in Waterproof. I can sometimes get really watery eyes in the wind and this mascara always seems to stay put whilst also giving lots and lots of volume. I could do with one that offers a bit more length though. To contour, I'm going to be using my Sleek Contour Kit. I'm first going to apply the bronzer with my Real Techniques Contour Brush down my cheekbones and then eventually up to my temples and downwards. I will eventually blend this in with my Real Techniques buffing brush to make sure that there's no harsh lines. As for blush, I love the Milani Bates Blush in Coralina for the summer. It gives such a perfect glowy and healthy finish and I'm simply applying this with my Elizabeth Arden Blush Brush. I'll then highlight with the Sleek Contour Kit. For the last step I'm going to use my Maybelline Colour Elixir in the shade Blush Essence. I've been loving glosses recently and this is just the perfect shade for summer. So there we go, that's my finished makeup look, however my hair looks like a complete disaster. As I was short on time I didn't really do much with my hair, I decided just to straighten it but because I already have pretty straight hair it only took about 2 minutes. I would have loved to curl it but with the thickness and length of my hair that would have taken about an hour and a half and I really didn't have that time. So let's take a look at my outfit then. As it wasn't warm enough I decided to just wear jeans and a top. My skinny jeans are from Forever 21 and shoes are from Tesco's. I recently purchased my top from River Island and although it's black I feel that the cut out shoulders give it more of a summery vibe. My out of focus coin necklace is from Forever 21. And my rabbit ears ring is from H&M. So that's it. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Also leave a comment if you'd like to as I love hearing what everyone has to say. So I hope you have an absolutely wonderful day and I'll see you on my next video. Bye! We're now down at Niagara Falls. It's pretty big. It's a cold as well, so I should have bought a jumper or cardigan.